guys it is currently new year's eve 2023 last day of 2023 and i actually came to dollar tree i don't have any special plans or anything today so i just wanted to come and film and do what i do because this is like an off day for me it's the weekend still and this is like one of the only times when i can really like go out and film and stuff because of work so i definitely have to take advantage and of course want to take you guys along with me so i'm going to film youtube clips and i'm also going to film for my instagram and my tiktok so let's go into dollar tree see what we can find on this in new year's eve and also i'm hoping to find the new valentine's day stuff there's a lady in her car ahead of me who's like looking at me like i'm really weird for filming this but i'm really hoping to find the new Valentine's Day stuff. So I'm excited. Let's go inside and see what we can find. All right, so we are starting out in the Valentine's Day section. I was so excited to see what they had. And of course, everything is so cute. Valentine's Day decor is definitely like one of my favorite things to see because I just love all the hearts. So here's kind of like an overview. A lot of stuff is from last year, but they do have a lot of new stuff as well. Look at these cute signs. These are new. Um, they're different from the ones from last year and they're just so fun. I love them. Here's a little welcome sign. This one's also new. Uh, it's a little hard to see, but there is glitter on it. It says love. And then there was another love sign. This one's cute too with all the candy hearts on it. Then we have this little jar sign and then this one as well. Uh, these were one of my favorites, these kissing booth little stand-up signs with the flags. This was this one is the pink one. These are so adorable. And they are really nice quality as well. These are new, these little flower trucks. We have the classic mason jar signs. Some cute little houses. And then here are some more signs. This one is fun. It has a heart with a key on it. And here is a red one with also a key. Here is another one of those trucks. This one says Cupid's Confectionery. Some gnome signs. And then these are fun. They're these little candy heart dispenser signs. That one says, I choose you. Fun little play on words. This is a sign with a fuzzy heart on it. And then we also have it in this like fun little pink color. Here is another sign that says, my love, be mine. They had these last year. This is also new. Cute little books with different titles. These are new bags. They are so pretty. This one is my favorite. It's even prettier in person. They have this new beaded heart wreath. This is my other favorite bag. I love the candy hearts and the glitter. This one is also adorable. It's a little bit smaller and it's a paper bag. Then we have the tote bags, which are nice because they're reusable. This one says Farm Fresh Valentine's with a little red truck. Here is a heart bag. And then this one is also so cute. You can use these all year. This is a, a, a flower sack towel. They had a ton of stickers for the holiday as well. Lots of fun ones to choose from. These had little glitter in it that moved around. Some more moving glitter stickers. This is a foil curtain. That will be cute for like a classroom if you're a teacher. We have Valentine's Day window clings. Of course, they had socks. They had a lot of knee highs. I really like these with the little red hearts. This is new for this year and very cute. It's a year of date nights. So you get 52 date cards. You can see the one in there that says beach day. They also have these new novelty heart sunglasses. These are so adorable. They're not for like, you know, protecting your eyes from the sun, but they're just like cute and fun. They also brought back the candy heart dispenser. This actually does work. And these really fun glitter plates with the glitter moves around. I don't know if those are food safe, but they're cute for decoration. Here's an overview of some other Valentine's Day finds. We have these heart straws. These cute heart sunglasses. These come in a pack. These are door banners. 
They had these last year as well, these paper coffee cups with the hearts on them. And they have this design as well. This is cute. It's a microfiber hair wrap with lips on it in the beauty section. They also have a matching towel scrunchie for when your hair is wet. These are nail files. This is one of my favorites. It's a, a hair comb. And they also have these new heart little spa headbands. And these are nicer quality than the ones that they have in the regular hair aisle all year. This is a great find. They have these rose shaped makeup brushes. These are so cute. They have a few different colors and the brush is actually really soft. I thought that was such a fun find. Here's another little makeup brush. We have a swirl lip gloss set. These new hot and cold iPads. They don't have the heart ones this year. These just have like little diamonds on them. We also have these pom-pom lip glosses. These are cute if you're like making a little gift bag for I don't know, a kid or preteen or something. And then they have these little um, stands in silver and gold, which I had not seen before. We also have some new mini woven baskets, which they came out with last year. Now they're adding in some more styles. We have these new makeup remover towels. These are so cute. They're in the shape of a heart. And then a couple of these little duo buddies that I found. We also have some cute little heart baskets. They brought these back. These are my favorite, the longer heart baskets. I have one of these to hold my setting sprays. So cute. And then they have these larger baskets as well, which is nice if you're building a Valentine's Day gift basket. Here are some cookie jars. Here is a larger heart plastic bowl. These are date dice. So they have all cute little things on them. Slow dance, compliment each other, game night. These are new. They're these really cute light up love signs. Gold and black. I loved this little cat sign. And here is a dog one. Another one of those baskets with the gold foil on top. A little preview of Easter. I found these garlands, which were so cute. This one was my favorite with the pink and blue. I love these notebooks. They are so pretty. They have rhinestones with a little um, f f ugh, velvet on the cover, except the inside is just blank. There's no lines, but it's it's so pretty. Here are more notebooks that I found. These did have lines on the inside. These are the candle holders, now in gold. They also had these diamond painting keychains in the craft section, as well as these larger diamond painting sheets. And you like place the little diamonds down. It's really cool. They have these ink pads, which I don't know if I've shown you guys these before, but these are newer for sure. We have some new cupcake iron-on patches, so fun. And then they have these little butterfly ones. Okay, we have this really exciting new find. This is the Be Pure Glow Up Serum, which is supposed to, of course, be a dupe for the Glow Recipe Watermelon line. So I was so excited to find this. Let me know if you guys have tried this yet, but they have a serum and they also had a night moisturizer, which again is the dupe for the Glow Recipe Watermelon Overnight Mask. So I'm really excited. They're starting to come out with a lot of fun dupes like this. And of course, they're only $1.25. Then I saw these body scrubs and these reminded me so much of Bath and Body Works. This one smells like warm vanilla sugar. We have Cherry Blossom. This one is a dupe for a Calvin Klein fragrance. And then this one is supposed to be like Victoria's Secret Love Spell. And this is actually a matching body spray that looks a lot also like Bath and Body Works. And then they have these matching body washes to go with it. In the beauty section, I found this Volcanic Stone Absorbing Facial Rollerball, which basically takes away the oil on your face and you can reuse it and rewash it. 
some Revlon lip gloss in a really ugly color, <laughs> this Alme Single Shadows. I found two shades. These new nail decals, I actually picked these up because I want to try them, and they had this really cool like other pattern. This I found, um, it's a name brand fine. It would be great to pick up for a baby shower basket. It's a name brand pacifier clip. And they're actually in really cute little prints. These are also name brand fine. They're these fuzzy baba socks. And I actually saw these on Amazon. One for anywhere from $10 to $17, like this specific brand. So I thought that was a great find. Another thing I found is this pink sauce which apparently has went like viral. It's made by a chef and I don't know. I it's thought it was pretty cool to find that at Dollar Tree. Last thing I found are these stuff puffs. They had salted caramel. I'm sure these have like so much sugar, but they looked so good. And they also had this one in cookies and cream. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Bye.